so if you want to start something of your own or if you want to do something but you are not doing that because you are afraid of the competition then this video is going to help you a lot so yesterday i was talking to one of my consulting clients and he wanted to start his own youtube channel and he wanted to start the youtube channel in motivational niche he wanted to be a motivational speaker and he told me that he is not starting the channel he is not putting out videos because he feels like there are already people who are doing really good in motivational niche and uh, he feels like there is no scope for him to start his own youtube channel now because he feels there is there are already people who are doing that so who is going to listen to him and he wanted my opinion about it so i told him having a competition is actually a good thing right so just think about it let's say you want to do something you want to start something of your own and you find out that there is no youtube channel about it there is no book that has been written on that topic there is no one who is selling a course on that topic so what does it mean if if nothing is happening in that niche that means there is no audience who is ready to consume content in that particular niche right because if there was already an audience which wanted information about that niche there would have been someone would be creating content for that niche okay so if if you are waiting to find such a niche where no one has started a channel where no one has written a book where no one has launched a course that's a very dangerous strategy that's a very risky strategy because you don't know whether the audience in that niche will buy your course or not you don't know whether the audience in that niche will watch your videos or not okay but if you have a competition that means that person is already creating the contents that that means that person is already selling his course and there are people who is consuming his content all right there are people who is buying his courses so if you have a competition that means your niche is already validated if you have a competition that means there is already an audience which is present who is ready to consume content information in your niche and that is a good sign okay that means you don't need to worry about validating your niche that means you don't need to worry about if i start my channel if i launch my course will people read it or not because if your competitor is putting out videos if your competitor is putting out course and people are consuming that means there is audience out there who is consuming the content who is buying the courses so your niche is validated now the next question you could have is so if that person is already doing that if he is already selling the course if he is already um, making videos in that niche why will anyone listen to me and the answer is people is people are going to listen to you because you are different everyone is different no matter how many people are there in the motivational niche if a new person comes his his opinion his style his way of teaching his way of explaining everything will be different from the earlier guys who are already doing it okay so some people will resonate with your competitors and some people will resonate with you because you are unique the way you present your content is unique the way you put your ideas is unique the way you uh, share your opinions your ideas um, the way of teaching your way of explaining that will be different every person is different so your version of that uh, idea is completely different from someone else so there will be people who will be interested in your style of teaching there will be people who will be attracted to your videos there will be people who will be attracted to your kind of content that's why it's very important whatever you want to do you need to be authentic okay if you are starting a motivational youtube channel don't look at what others are doing and try to copy that because if you are doing that that, that means you are just preparing yourself for failing because if you are copying someone else people will not resonate with you so much because they have already resonated with that person they are already watching his videos so if you are copying that they are not people are not able to see the real you but if you don't copy and you be yourself be authentic be genuine and you put your content in your own style 
right if you do that some of the people will like you better than your competitor i'm not saying that 100% of all the people everyone will stop watching your competitors videos and start watching your videos it will not happen and that's good thing right because you don't need 100% of the audience you just need a set of audience from the entire audience and those will be your loyal fans those will be the people who will resonate with your message those will be the people who will like your style of delivery they will like how you you are presenting your content so don't worry about competition at all in fact you should worry if there is no competition at all if there is no competition that means you are entering into a very risky and dangerous zone and uh, then you have to figure out everything on your own if you have a competition you have so many advantages so apart from validating the niche apart from validating that there is audience out there who is ready to watch the content uh, there is one more advantage and that advantage is you can see what is working well so if you have a competitor and he is doing really good you can go and see how he is presenting his content what kind of topic he is covering what kind of courses he is launching and if he, if and if he has paying customers you can see what kind of uh, products people are consuming where people are paying money uh, are they purchasing online courses are they buying one on one consulting are they uh, buying membership sites and that validates your business idea as well and one more thing you can do is you can go to his content you can look at all the comments you can look at what kind of questions people are asking you can look at what kind of comments they are posting and you will be able to understand the needs of your audience so much better so you should be very very happy that you have a competitor because uh, you'll get so many ideas from your competitor and as i mentioned you don't have to worry about if he is already doing it then who is going to listen to me or who is going to watch my content or who is going to buy my course you be yourself you be authentic and you put out your content in your own way and there will be some people who will be attracted to you who will resonate with you much better who will like your style of delivery and they will be your loyal fans so that's what you should be doing so i hope i answered the question if you have any more questions just let me know in the comments below thank you so much for watching have a great day